Hey, it's Pupmeister, and today we are going to look at how to make an iron golem. So let's get to it. We're going to need four blocks of iron and a pumpkin. And I'm not going to make them in here. <laughs> so let's go out here. We'll go over by the creeper farm here where we get our gunpowder. Be good to have somebody guarding the beehives and over here. So, for the blocks of iron, you want to put them just like this in a T formation. And as far as the pumpkin is concerned, you have to make it a jack-o'-lantern. So if you're not sure how to make a jack-o'-lantern out of a pumpkin, you just use shears, just like that. And then you can break it. And all you have to do is put it on top. Thought I heard somebody sneak it up on me there. <laughs> all you have to do is put it on top, just like that, in the middle. And you've got an iron golem. And what's best about this iron golem? You can punch it. You can axe it. <laughs> they will never attack the person who made them. So if you're sick of your villager iron golems attacking you because of a mistake or whatever... Just make a whole bunch of these and you'll never have that problem again. Especially when you are later in the game, you'll have a ton of iron. As you can see in my inventory, I'm much later in the game. You, I've got a ton of gold, a ton of iron, and it just gets this way. I mean, I didn't even, I didn't even mine iron for a while. And if you have a pickaxe, Fortune 3, just as you randomly go through the caves and stuff, you'll find tons of iron. So you can make all the golems you want. You can even make an army of iron golems if you've got a raid coming to help defend. So let's go into the corner chest. Of course, our first one is full with the first 54 episodes. And we're just going to put a block of iron in here. <laughs> and of course, if you don't know how to make a block of iron, it's nine iron ingots. And this is episode number 74. Thank you so much for watching. Have yourself a great day. And don't forget to subscribe. Bye for now.